Hello, so uh, today I will show you how to convert a big lighter like this into this device that is like same lighter but without the metal casing and the stuff so you can use that as a to generate spark to start fire very easy so you can use a lighter that is already empty so no uh, butane gas inside like when the lighter is finished it's not making the fire anymore so you can dismantle it and make this device uh, that is very useful and it's going to make spark for quite a long time even after there is absolutely no gas inside <coughs> so I didn't have an empty lighter so what I did is I empty one I empty the gas of this one to show you uh, how to proceed so for removing the gas you can put an elastic band uh, in the gas button and so you let the lighter empty itself uh, all uh, for 24 hours outside <coughs> so once that when this is done you need a pair of plier in the inside the hole of the lighter so you apply some torque in the metal casing both sides to remove it this is very easy to do next step you took the protection here and just take it out like that and there is the more tricky part now because first you have to look uh, because the the wheel is not symmetric so when it's turned on one side it's going to make the spark and if you run on the other side it's not going to make the spark so you need to be careful and look at the side and put it back in the original fashion after <coughs> and as the flint is held by a, a spring it can easily go out when you going to pop out the the wheel so uh, it's better me I doing that inside a ziplock bag so this way everything is going to stay inside and I don't have to worry about losing the flint so when inside the ziplock bag you pop out one side of the wheel wheel and you do same thing with your finger the other side so now it's done we can take this out so then we have the spring we have the flint we have the scratching steel wheel and we have that part uh, to which we're going to by putting this out this is not so easy because usually it's tend to go back when you take one out it's the first one go back inside but with some practice it's it's go out like that these these part we're not going to use it okay so now we have the place with the metal where the original uh, <coughs> butane exit was so you put back the spring you took the flint And carefully put back the spring and the flint inside in place okay then you stop it with the wheel like that 
then you put back the wheel in place in the original side okay so you push back you you block it with the wheel and then you 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 put it back in place with the two things and then you get very nice device thank you for watching so the last thing I forget to mention about that <coughs> is if you find some empty lighter on the street because some people has throw them uh, not in the garbage but just on the street and don't care about environment so much uh, what you can do is you can easily uh, take uh, it and uh, open it the same way and uh, extract the flint extract the ferro uh, cerium alloy so by recuperating this you can always use the same lighter like that but just when the flint is completely over you take out the wheel and then you put a uh, new one or recuperated one and so this way you can have uh, plenty uh, of you can generate plenty of spark out from almost nothing and to show you how, how nice the spark are like I will let uh, 0 0 0 0 uh, steel wool as standard with uh, that you see it's lit almost instantly so the spark from from that device can be very very useful for outdoor situation